Yay. Today is my birthday. I am turning 12. Again. I wish I got to age like everyone else. But no I stay 12 for a long time. I hope I got a four-wheeler for my birthday. Because I asked my parents for one. And they said we'll see. Yay. What am I waiting for? I am going downstairs. And also today is the first day of April. I am happy because today is Kalu's birthday. He's turning 12 for the fifth time, but whatever. We'll be deciding when he should age. I am inviting a few new people over to celebrate his birthday. Happy birthday, Kalu. Let's open your first gift from the family. The gift is outside. Yay. I may know what it is. Let's go. Oh my god. My very own four-wheeler. I've always wanted to have one. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate this gift. You're welcome. But the rules are no driving it inside the house. No throwing Leo onto the four-wheeler without his permission. And definitely don't let Rosie ride it without you. Mom, I want to ride the four-wheeler. I want to be when I am older. Rosie? My little ginger girl. Do you even know what the word thug means? Yeah, it means being total badass and living life on the edge. I want to be a guy wearing all leather and skateboarding on the Grand Canyon. Rosie, you are not supposed to say the word badass, okay? Rosie? You are too young to be saying that. I can do what I want. Door is the door head. Rosie, how dare you talk back to me? That's it. You are grounded for 666 days. Go to your room right now. Kalu go take it for a spin. Mom and I are going to get prepared for your party this afternoon. Wow a nice 10 minute ride through the town with my sick four wheeler. We are at Plymouth Rock. I am going to use the rock as a ramp to make my four wheeler go faster and perform a stunt. What the? Did I just see that you own a four wheeler? That is extremely illegal to do in a city like this. That's it. I am going to bust some bald ass. You owe police car. Come to me. Kalu, how was riding the four wheeler? Awesome. Dad, I went through the city and the town. Guests will be coming over in several hours to celebrate your birthday. Well, anyways, I am going to play on my golden Xbox until guests start coming. Boris, can I poke at your chest for a second? I need to test out my chest thinner Grandma and Grandpa got for Kalu for his birthday. Why, sure. But, I don't understand why you think Kalu's chest is too thin. I think it's fine the way it is. Oh. Boris, the doctor said like six months ago, that Kalu's chest is 0.2% thinner than normal kids his age. Oh, Boris your chest is thick and meaty. That's good, Boris. That is what I want Kalu's chest to be like. Well, 0.2% thinner than other kids is fine. No one will go up to him and say hey skinny chest. No one would even care or notice. I don't care, Boris. I want his chest the normal size, just in case if there is any diseases that will come along in the future. Playing on my golden Xbox is so fun. I heard on the golden Xbox the graphics are a bit better than a regular Xbox.
That must be the first guest arriving. Who, are you coming to my birthday party, officer? No, I'm not coming to your party. I am here because you broke the law. But, officer, I didn't do anything wrong. What did you think I did? You did do something wrong, because you were the only bald kid speeding on a four-wheeler in a big city. That is against the law. I expect a fine of two million dollars to be paid this month. Look, officer, I didn't mean to do that. I am only 12 years old, and I know nothing about laws. So, please let me off the hook this time. Again, I am sorry. You are a complete liar, Caillou. You are 12 years old. You should definitely know about laws and safety. I expect two million dollars to be paid by the end of this month. If not, arrested. Wow, I can't believe I have to pay a $2 million fine by the end of this month for no reason. I seriously didn't know about that law. Did I just hear that you broke the law and that you have to pay a $2 million fine? Whoa, Dad, where did you come from? I was in the backyard getting prepared for the party, and I saw a police car parked in front of our house. You are grounded from using your four-wheeler for five months. I am going to store it in the garage until then. I can't believe I can't use my four-wheeler for five months. This is so unfair. Hello, Grandma and Grandpa. Oh, happy birthday, K.I.U. It will be definite that you will like Grandpa and I's gifts that we bought you. Great. I hope Grandma and Grandpa bought me a backup four-wheeler. I'm really happy that I got one. And the stupid police officer had to ruin everything. Oh, hello. Who are you? I am SD Soccer 24. And I am stopping by to say hello to you, Kalu. I'm a big fan. Wow, thank you so much, SD Soccer 24. We should become friends. We should. What the? Who is that by the doorstep? Dad. Meet my new friend SD Soccer 24. He just stopped by to say hi to me, and he is a big fan of me. Oh, really? Kalu, how many times am I supposed to say this? Quit talking to strangers. But, Dad, he's not a stranger if we are friends. Kalu, you should ask my permission before getting a new friend. I hate it when you and Rosie talk to strangers without me being notified first. Kalu, how dare you talk to a stranger? That's it. After the party is over, you are grounded for 200 years, and you'll be going straight to your room. So, SD Soccer 24. You should be heading back home now. I am glad that you like Galu, but my son isn't allowed to talk to strangers. Now, Galu stay by the doorstep and wait for more people to arrive. Wow, Dad is making me so mad right now. I can't believe I am not even allowed to make new friends, that is just plain ridiculous. What, Miss Martin, why are you coming to my party? It wasn't my idea to come. It was my husband's, because he is wicked good friends with your father. So, Kalu, how's my wife been treating you lately in class? Very good. I haven't gotten in trouble in months. I've been a saint. That's a lie. Just last week, Gaylu put a whoopee cushion on my chair, and when I sat in the chair, it made a farting noise. Don't lie in front of my husband, Kalu. Oh he, he, I didn't do that, Leo did, he just took the blame on me. Quit lying Kalu. Leo is more of a saint than your ass will ever be. If you lie one more time, you will get a detention from me on Monday. So, did you bring me gifts for my birthday? For the last time, Kalu. We aren't here for your stupid party, Kalu. We're here to see your father. I am not associating with other guests, only your father. So, quit asking. Wow what a rip off. My teacher and her weird looking husband is at my house. I should have hidden some traps for them to step on. Hi, ginger boy. You finally gingered over here. Quiet. 
Baldy. So, my father has your gift, but he threw it into a lake, because I told him you call me a ginger all the time, so I am here because my mom made me drag my ass over here. I didn't want to come, I wanted to go to the mall with Sarah and Clementine. But I wanted to go to the mall with you guys. Well that's too bad, Kalu. You are so mean to me, so I am not inviting you to come. Besides, Sarah and Clementine both hate you to no end, and I'm starting to hate you too. Hello, Kalu. I'm Batman and this is my sidekick Robin. We bought you some gifts that you'll open up later. Hello. I am Mr. Incredible and everyone introduce yourselves. I am Mrs. Incredible. I am Violet. I am Dash. And I am Jack Jack. I am Fat Albert and this is my new friend Timmy Turner. Okay nice to meet you guys. That looks like the last of them. I am now going to go into the backyard. Okay, everyone. Time for cake. Alright, the cake was delicious. Now it's time for Kalu to open gifts. This one is from Grandma and Grandpa. A construction vest. What for? I don't do construction. No. It's not a construction vest. It's a chest thinner, because your chest is skinnier than normal kids your age. This gift is from Batman and Robin. A Batman shoe. Um thanks. And this final gift is from Fat Albert and Timmy Turner. A red sweater. I only wear yellow shirts. No offense, Fat Albert and Timmy Turner but your gift sucks. Kalo. How dare you say Fat Albert and Timmy Turner's gift sucks? That's it. You are grounded for 250 years. Go to your room right now, and put on your chest thinner. 